First John chapter one verse verse one My little children, these things write I unto you that ye sin not and if any man sin we have an advocate with the Father Yahweh Shah Mashiach the righteous And he is the propitiation for our sins. And not for ours, ours only, but also for the sins of the whole world. I'd like to give all prayers and honor and glory to Yahweh Shah, the Wadi Yahweh Shah, for giving us the apostles and the elders of Great Millstone. Rightfully so. The honors. To those great men who has prepared us for what is to come and what is to come race wars concentration camps famine thermonuclear fire salaki the rfid chip was the mark of the beast thermonuclear fire simultaneously 200 missiles 200 million missiles hitting the soils of america simultaneously the cherries of the lords lifting up the whole for elect because that's who he's come back for the whole for elect Laser beams being shot all over the place, people getting turned to powder. Rightfully so. And um that's what we prepared to come. That's what that's what we've been prepared for. And who else we're preparing us right now? Through the spirit of Shemel Shah, the apostles of Great Millstone. The elders, the Akim, pushing the word of sincerity and truth. So right now, I'm gonna make it clear, because it's accurate. Alright? We belong to the apostles of Great Millstone until Yahweh Shah gets back. That's plain and simple. They have taken care of us with the scriptures, so we take care of them financially to the best of our ability. You know, we take care of our homes, we take care of our little bills, and we give. We give out we give our tights, our offerings to the to the men. We take care of them. And the spirit of Yahweh Shimon Shah is is rightfully so. Because what would you be doing? You know? What would you be doing right now? Just ask yourself that. Alright? So um our advocate is Yahweh Shah. But um our shepherds right now is the apostles of Great Millstone. They till in the land, and how they till in the land? They 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 feeding us with the, with the seeds. They they putting the seeds out there in our minds to know you how I see our shot. Keep us focused. All right, that's what they doing, and that's a beautiful thing. That's how we that's how we know what we know now. All right, so uh. Um, let me see here. Let me let's see if I can get the pronunciation of this word here. Right. Hold on, it's a lot here. We're gonna go into the word advocate. The Greek. Okay. Parakitos. Parakitos. Uh. Balakitos. That's how you say um, advocate, advocate in Greek. Okay. So you know, just trying to go through a word. That's how you say it. All right. All right let's see. Let's go back. All right. A Samoan called to one side, especially called to one side. One's one's aid, ones who plead another cause, ones one who pleads another cause before a judge, a pleader, a counsel 
for defense, legal assistance, an advocate, right? one who pleads another cause with one, an intercessor, okay? That's Yahweh Shah. That's who he's doing that right now for us. So he's our advocate. But at the same time, you know, it's always been prophets set on the earth to do the will of Yahweh Shah. Yahweh Shah. So right now, the prophet of the Lord is the great millstone. Okay? All right? All right. Um, it says right here, of Mashiach, Hamashiach, his exhortation at the right hand, I mean, at Yahweh's right hand, pleading with Yahweh, the Father, for the pardon of our sins but for the hopeful elect sins right now I ain't like your Lord Yahweh I know they did this please look 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 what they're doing now though this is what they're doing because we all we all we all fall short to sin but through the spirit of Yahweh the Lord got his hopeful elect alright alright let's go back all right, um, hmm. I'll just read this next verse here. It says, um, first, this John, first John chapter two, verse two, and he is the propitiation for our sins, and not for ours only, but also for the sins of the whole world. Okay, let's, let's go. Let's see what this word says in Greek. All right, slap you. See what it says in Greek. Okay. Lesmos. 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 I'm not too, you know, familiar speaking fluent, but it, uh, klezmo, that's how you say pro propitiation in Greek, right? And it says, in appearance, propitiating, the means of appearing a propitiation. All right, let's see here. See what this word says right here. So we gotta go in depth with some some words like the apostles always say. You gotta go, you know, you gotta bring out the words. Let's see what this says. Concretely. 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 I mean, he's a solid. Is solid. All right. He's solid with it. All right. Yeah. He's sticking to it. All right. He's pleading with Yahweh Shemel Shah, and he's saying, "Listen, this is still your people. This is still what you need to be. You know, we still gotta, we still need a righteous judges to judge the earth. From the beginning, remember they helped, they helped me." Um, built the galaxies they, they was there with me so this is the ones and look look at the men right here these men right here these are genuine men these are genuine soldiers because remember Yahweh is not Yahweh is not dealing with us um, directly Yahweh Shah is the mediator he's the bridge to Yahweh because we want to do judges the Yahweh, Yahweh is always getting us out of situations sending judges we go wrong, he send he send other nations on top of us. So that was justice. We sin, he put us he put us down. We we do the right thing, he raises us up. So this is a solid, this is a concrete thing that the Yahweh Shah is doing for us. Yahweh Shah is doing for us. He's gonna raise the 144,000 men and the one third men, women, and children, and we're gonna rule the earth in righteousness, and we're gonna bring back two thirds. So that's beautiful. 
Alright? So, how about Shema is praying for Yeah, how Shah is praying for us? Okay? He's doing the praying, praying for us. And and so are the so are the apostles. Because they got a, you know, they got a job to do too. And they give us the same job too. To go forward and push this word. For Yahweh Shem Al Shah. And for 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 Shem Al Shah, for Yahweh's sake, his word's sake, and for Yahweh Shah's sake, and for our own sake. So this is the right thing to do. Which is a beautiful thing. Alright. So the shepherds of Yahweh Shah are also um here to do a do a job too. And when we when they pass the baton down to us, we got a job to do. Do the spirit of Yahweh Shah. Alright. Cause that's a beautiful this is beautiful to to get to this point to know it okay all through the spirit of Yahweh Shemel Shah it's a lot here I had another verse um okay all right I um this is um this is John chapter 17 verse 9 for I pray for I pray for them I pray not for the world, but for them which thou hast given me, for thy, for they are thine. Okay. All right. So we belong to the the, the whole full elect belongs to Yahweh, the whole full elect belongs to Yahweh Shah, and the whole full elect belongs to the apostles of Great Millstone. This is an order. Okay. Because they gave us the truth. They had it. It was given to them. They manifested. They brought it to another level. And then it was given to us. And we, we carried a baton. Because it's going to be a point where the Yahweh Shemel Shah name is going to have to be proclaimed. And that's what we're doing now. But it's, it's going to be on the next level. And then and you're, going, and, and you're, going to either, you're either going to turn against the name or you're going to die for the name. So I just wanted to bring that out because we belong to the apostles of Great Millstone too. All right, through the Spirit of Yahweh Shemel Shah. Okay, all prayers and honor and glory go to Yahweh Shemel Shah, the Wadi Yahweh Shemel Shah for giving us the apostles and the elders of Great Millstone, rightfully so, who deserve the honors. Shalom to the Akim, pushing the word in sincerity and in truth and being faith-based. Shalom.